What is up, guys? Welcome back. Now, yeah, okay, so yesterday I uploaded my uh, weekly VIP for Global. Um, this video is being recorded yesterday, so um, basically I was mentioning that I, I did not have enough jewels to get uh, the Zigbar medal guaranteed because I did not buy VIP, which I can honestly show you guys. I did not buy VIP um, still. I ended up grinding some um, some quests that I, I didn't do, I guess the ones they just I updated into the game, and I got enough jewels to actually pull that last time. So you see, I haven't bought VIP this week. Um, once again, I want to mention, you know, if you do need to upgrade your, your Keyblade, you can buy this, but I just wouldn't unless they give you a decent medal. Um, and from now on, I think just Global is going to be getting Avatar parts with 1,400 jewels on top of the 3k they already gave you. Um, but what we're going to do, since I have enough now, um, I'm going to I'm going to pull this last pull. It's ending today in five hours. And then, well, basically, yesterday it's ending. It, it ended yesterday. This video is recorded today. We're going to pull this last thing. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and um, we're going to trait this metal so we're guaranteed to get him this time around we're just going to go ahead and trade him so there we go and wow that's actually not a bad pull i got a um uh kingdom Hearts 3 young xehanort boosted that's pretty cool i also got a boosted kingdom Hearts 3 soldier and then we got the zigbar and we also got a sephiroth ex plus um, and copy metals are always great to have, so HD Shion is there. Not too bad. Hmm. I am shook. Alright, so we're gonna go ahead. We are going to, um... We're gonna jump into... Uh... I, I unlocked the training slot, but I can't train anything. Alright, so... Um... What we're gonna do is we're gonna go to the metal. And we are going to put his traits on there we're just going to run traits see what we get for um the traits and then you know from there we'll just figure it out so there we go all right we're gonna level him up maybe i should lock him in first right yeah all right we're gonna do some trait rolls and then what's left we'll go ahead and uh We'll go ahead and put the speed stuff on him so I can level him up. And I think I have enough to actually upgrade him some more. I figured I would save this video for today since I had no idea what to actually upload for you guys today. So, um, we're just going to go ahead and try to do this. I'm just glad I actually got this medal. Um, I just, I don't know, for some reason I really wanted, uh, Zigbar, just because of how important he is now to the Kingdom Hearts series. Um, I just felt like I just needed, I needed to have him. Obviously, I still need to trade the goofies that they gave us, and look at all them stitch stuff. I, I don't even have... Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and do our first roll. Sleep Resist. I usually let them roll all the way, but I've been having better luck with just tapping it. Alright. This looks like it's going to be a rating medal. Strength, thank god. Cool. Defense. Okay. Now if we got extra attack, though. Oh! What? What? I called it, bro. We just got extra attack. That's actually pretty cool, man. That's pretty damn cool. Alright, so... Since we're down here, we'll go ahead and we'll optimize him. Level him up. And then... Go from there. I've heard that um, this metal is pretty good. 
But I basically just told you why I really wanted them. I'm really glad I thought about going through them quest to get I didn't even realize how many jewels I was missing just from not doing the quest. We're gonna see if we can evolve him now. Evolve. Alright. Sad part is I don't even know what this metal does. I haven't watched too many things on him because I just wanted to see for myself. <laughs> but see, my weakness with metals is um is actually speed. So um, everybody has their good and their bad um, sets of metals. I'm really good with power metals and I'm really good with uh, magic metals. But uh, my lack was in speed. And lately I've been getting a lot of decent speed metals that would really help my gameplay out a lot so um always try to when you're pulling if you're new because if you're if you've been here for uh playing this game for a long time um you would already know this but if you are new and you are pulling and you see that you're getting a bunch of um one type of metal go for the ones that um you have less of so if you have less speed go for the ones that you um, need. So if you don't have so much of speed metals, try to go for the ones that are, um, there for speed. Or the same as anything else, you know, if you have, like, a magic, if you don't have a lot of magic, go for the magic metals. Um, because there's events that come around where you need certain types of metals to do certain types of things, and sometimes, and if you play on Proud, there's a lot of times where you need a certain type of metal. So, just keep that in mind if you are new. We're going to go ahead and try to put some Chippendales on this since I have a shit ton of Chippendales. Obviously, you can see that now. Um, we can put 3k on him now. Which, it's good that with VIP, you do get to farm these Chippendales. It does help out a lot, because for the longest time of me playing this game, there was no farming Chippendales. Like, you, th these were things that you had to really work on getting. Which, now, you know, you don't have to do that anymore. But as I said, you know, usually I am VIP every week, and this week is the first week I will not be purchasing, purchase, purchasing it throughout any time of the week so it's going to be really weird because for the last past year and a half i've been vip like every week um i do want to say though it is the cheapest way to get um it is the cheapest way to ignore targets attributes it's the cheapest way to get um a lot of different uh, um more jewels for your money it is but um to pump it out every week though i wish they gave you like an option to oh it's only two gauges i don't think i should do an eight that's two gauges hmm We'll go ahead and do that. Yep. We'll go ahead and do that. And I don't think I have enough SIDs to... Actually, I don't think I have any SIDs. Oh, I do. I have one. I'm going to save that. I really should start working more on my SIDs. But that's basically my Zigbar. So, um, if I do, you know, I'll roll this for you guys. And if I don't do it on like like while i'm recording i'll just snap a picture of it and show you what i get from my special trait if it's something good um 
you know, I've been having crappy luck with the pet slots uh, lately. So, yeah, that's about it, guys. Remember to leave this video a huge like. Subscribe if you haven't already. Remember, if you want to get a, a chance of winning any of my giveaways, the main thing to do is subscribe. And if you want a chance at winning $100 for either Google Play or Apple, you can head over to my 500 subscriber giveaway video. Comment what your favorite keyword is and who your favorite character is in Kingdom Hearts. And that will enter you in a chance at winning $100 for either Google Play or Apple. If you do want to join the Wayfinders, which is the group that you're looking at right now, this is our hardcore global group. We do have a JP group, and we have other casual groups that are intertwined with the Wayfinders. You can go down in our description box down below and um, and just join our Discord. So once you join our Discord, you can meet everybody and, you know, get used to having everybody uh, bullshit with one another and we can set you up in one of the groups that best fits the way that you play So if you're casual, we'll set you up in one of our casual groups. If you're hardcore, we'll try to um, Put you in one of our in this group right here um, and also down there is a bunch of uh, Channel links so those channels down there are actually the content creators in the wayfinders and you know if you go through and see one of their um, channels, you can go ahead and give them a heads up that you found their channels through me. They'd probably really appreciate that I'm giving them some foot traffic to their channel. And we also have a Kingdom Hearts Amino. So if you want to join our Amino, you can do that too. That's linked down below. And that's basically like a, a, a Kingdom Hearts like fan club that you can join, make a profile, and kind of just um, go ahead and just post whatever kind of Kingdom Hearts content that you, you want to do. And then um, we also have a Patreon now. So if you want to donate to my channel, you can through our Patreon, which is also linked down below. And, you know, if you do donate $5 or more, you get a shout out at the end of every video in the month that you are a Patreon. I always say it's not necessary because it isn't, but um, it does help our channel out. So it'll help us do better content, better giveaways, and um, to get supplies when I do DIY videos. And that is about it. And I don't know if you guys saw that or not, but one of these, one of these guys on here says "dick me." I'm trying to find out which one of these bros really just said that for real. Hold up. One of these. I know. I seen it. I think it was. Bro. Yo. Y'all seeing this? I guess it's a shout out to you, buddy. But, uh... What? <laughs> okay, so I, I saw it earlier, and it kind of really threw me off a lot. So, that's why I was kind of like, wait, uh, trying to figure out what I was going to say. That really threw me off when I saw the bubble come up on the main screen there. But, yeah. <laughs> uh, thank you guys for watching. And, as always, let your hearts be your guiding keys. Bye.